all right, just put hundred pound in this uh, blueprint terminal. Uh, playing this one here, Ambassador Roulette. Never ever played this before. Double zero, and it looks very much like Golden Oz Roulette. Uh, it's got a segment here, so I think this is like this is like um, Blueprint's version. Terrible bet, but you never know. Right, <laughs> seems like I'm just chucking my money away. Eh? All right. Top then of that, that spin just looks a bit like quite sluggish. So that hit, um, well, anything really apart from 20 to 1 and above, it would have been near jackpot. Well, 40 to 1 and above. All right, I cut these out of me about when it lands in that green segment again. Uh, now we're now. Right. Quite loud as well. Yeah, don't know what to think of that. You can change it. Yeah, gets rid of them. favourite of people's and of mine of course I do like this game thinking about gambling it but that's nice for the first second spin was it but a few more for it see if i can get a back-to-back uh, -back feature they do like stringing these features together i find mega tees just gonna pay these final seven off Because I was 
too close. Another nation favourite. Right, Max Bert. <laughs> There was a time, uh, once upon a time in Bet Fred's and William Hill's, this, this is all you heard. Uh, the music for this and teases and that noise when the cymbals come in. This game probably is one of the most popular games on the fob tees, I'd say. teasers in short succession. I right, just missed uh, it rolling but 16 quid. Uh, can I not gamble? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> None of the screens really work. Alright, black red. Yeah, I'll put it down to the medium. Oh, you can put it down. Yeah, yeah, I might actually do that. There you go. Just a little bit too loud. Line of them would be 40 quid. Ladybirds. Be nice to get onto the old dogs. That's where uh, it starts getting a bit excited because the, the values go up by a bit. I'm going to gamble this for a, uh, I'm going to go for a red. There you go then. Comes in, I'll collect it. Yeah. Okay. That's a nice little golden. That's a couple of lines of 40 quids. Wow. <laughs> She's a rolling and a half. Can I get another diet coke please? Yeah. Cheers Becky, thanks. I'm i I'm still gonna try and get a feature and then hit um hit a red. I mean stuff like that, that little rolling then, I mean it's very very tempting to hit that gamble but out of nowhere, you know. Hopefully, I get a bonus of some sort. Quickish. Literally, put the phone down. A few presses later, it's dropped in a feature. So this is, is this feature number three, is it? Was it number two? Can't remember. <laughs> I remember that last one was 77 quid. Can't remember if I had one before that or not. Tell you what's mega ultra rare whack it in the comments if you've had it three symbols land in a in sort of one spin you know or not in the bonus i can't remember how many extra spins it gives you i know two give you three spins is it five spins or seven spins Halfway through the bonus, 
one more upgrade and it's gonna get a little bit exciting. Spinning, a bit of shame. Last spin. Okay, that's a terrible bonus. Let's go for a black. Oh. <laughs> no, I played down the 400 and I'm going to switch games. So two more spins. Right. Final spin. Right, loading up another game. So not too bad on this one, 100 in, so 330 up on this uh, terminal at the moment, which puts me evens on the whole session. That might be across two parts. But I'll bring you up for the next game. All right, loading up this one, Convertus Iridium. I said that properly. No idea if I have. If it's too loud, I'll turn it down. I don't think I've ever played this game. Where's the info screen? There it is at the top. Do you know what? Let's just, let's just start. Thanks, better. Eh? Thank you very much. Um, I actually don't know what you need. Oh, scatters. Those, uh, those uh, blue little cauldrons. Three of them, I'm guessing. Sounds sounds does sound familiar. Maybe I've uh, been in bookies, playing other stuff, and heard it. I don't know. I never played it though. So hopefully we'll uh, bring you back for something. Feature hopefully. I right, just rolled in uh, that little win there. I was actually weren't recording, so I didn't think it was wild. Go for a black. Yeah. Go for red. <laughs> Not today. No idea what this bonus is like. Is it, is it a bit like I have horse? I, I generally don't know. These blueprints now start giving you like warnings, but I can't even remember them doing that. Well, it's quite hard to get a tease on this. Um, I don't know whether uh, it's just been me being a little bit like, sort of unlucky, but it doesn't seem to uh, tease too often. Shame they're not wild. That was the first proper tease I've had. Second tease, as soon as I said it. <laughs> yeah, similar reels. No, oh, maybe it does tease quite a bit, I don't know. I don't know. I've just missed the tease. Yeah, it just dropped off there at the bottom. Uh, I did give that a little well. First time playing it, I can't really judge it too much. Uh, doesn't really seem to uh, do much, really, base game. Maybe that 16 quid win was the highest I think I had. Red Ock Repeater. Yeah. Let's have a look what this is. Right, let's give this a go. Red Hot Respin Active. Thank you. 
I played this a few times. You need um, just a full screen or anything really to uh, to see it paying. Takes you up to the top for like repeat chances. You can get wins along the way. You can get um, full screen like that, um, and then you get a respin as well. all those oranges going past. Second chance. Squeeze it. If you get um, if you get the full screen it takes you to that, that thing at the top where you get like the win chance. But equally if you don't you still get the wins and they're eight pound a line for that particular symbol. See if I can get a win of some sort. Right, first little win, eight quid. Um, I really want to go for something, uh, something big. So when that times 10 comes in. Right, another little uh, rolling, six quid this time. Oh, I thought they were all eight pounds there, but there was a couple of uh, lower symbols. Uh, times four times 10. £30. Yeah. Um. Right, sorry. No, isn't it? Are you going to play these uh, auto plays plus down? Well, I'm actually going to play it down to 160. Down it a bit longer. I'm gonna try and chase that times five. Unless it drops in something monstrous. See that too often, those, those bars. I'm gonna do it for times five. If it comes in, I might go times two and collect. Right, it's coming. Could go for times five again. This would actually put me up 110 quid. So I'm gonna go for a double. Because I said I would. that came in. Yeah, I've got 
few of them now. I've just put more money in now. Or the balance is going up a little bit. Once I put this last 20 and that's uh, 200 in this terminal. What have I put in there? No idea. Couldn't, couldn't see what it says. Pretty sure that's 200 in now. I think I've definitely been a bit too greedy on this terminal. Did have the obviously the option of leaving with like 300 quid profit quite early on, but it's quite hard just to get wins on this. So if we was uh, getting accumulating quite a few wins, it'd be a bit easier to try and push the gamble. Start some more plays off. She landed on it and jumped off. <laughs> well, the audio said that it stopped on it and it just dinked off it. I'm sort of tracing a gamble now on this. straight away, I've seen it before. something because uh, I've got a shoot in a minute. Um, if I was to go for a times two and it come in again, that would be 104. Yeah. I was going to say if I can go for a times four after that, yeah, 245 in this. few on this and I'm going to switch games for the final 15-20 minutes and I'm going to have to shoot. That's just final, uh, final few presses. Not so. 
not so good when it keeps uh, missing out. down to 140 and I'm gonna spend the last little bit on um, high horse megaways times two times two has been not very good that's about eight or nine gambles and not once. And I once it landed. Shocking, really. Right. Um. Let's money out of the way. Power plane. Let's get the oil play on. This, this power play allows you to. Um, it allows you to uh, get a golden fish or whatever it's called. Bit. Features on this are mega rare. So I think it's a £10 winner and above. Gives you a chance of picking another fish. And there is a gamble as well, which I never knew initially. You know, it says red or black right at the bottom. It's always this one here. Very slow little gamble that was. Big old slow spin or turn of a card. Right, gonna find a few presses on this and I'm gonna um, play high horse megaways. It's not doing anything. Okay. I only had one uh, pick of the big fish that you saw. Final game. Currently 400 down. on this. Mm -hmm. Right, final game, hundred pound in this. Couple of these out. Hopefully bring you for a uh, an early spin. Right, game number one. That's a beach, isn't it? Ten. I can never ever get anything good on this. I mean, it's ultra play, so you get wins across. Go on. Get in there. All right. Do something. Get some expands in there. Okay. Oh, they're like growing. Seventy-one. I mean, if you got like premiums or expands in there, well, that, that might be quite good. Twenty quid. It's 
three spins remaining. Yeah. Still expands even though there's nothing uh, nothing in view. Or no wind there. Alright, final spin. So that's where you want where you want to win or something. Right. Um, let's go for uh, a double. Okay, it's part bank 200. I've got to go now, so it's a little bit of money back. Right, bank 200, gambling 30 pound a um, let's go for a shield. Uh, three. Yeah. Right. Got to go. I'll let you know how much I'm down or. I got on. Right, see you in a bit.